God's getting ready to turn the table on your enemy tonight. It ain't going to be a struggle. It ain't going to be a fight. But I hear him say tonight that his army is greater. His anointing is greater than any attack of the enemy. I'm talking to those in this house prophetically from the Lord. I heard him say that these next five days is going to be an open door. It just opened tonight in the spirit realm, saith the Lord God most high. And in this anointing right now, I see angels coming down from the sky. And the angels that are with us are more than they that are against us, for our God is a God of power. How many know that all it takes is one angel? One angel is all it takes because Psalm 91 decrees and tells us <laughs> he's going to give his angels charge over you. They're going to keep you in all your ways. No plague shall come nigh your dwelling. How many know that no evil, no weapon formed against you is going to prosper? If you believe that tonight, and you know that God has angels of the Lord encamping round about you even now, right now, and that you're being watched over by the throne room of God, that God has a heavenly host visiting us here tonight, then you need to say, Lord, I believe. Every one of you that is in this house tonight, I'm going to ask the Lord to send his angels before you. They're going to guard you, watch over you, and keep you, saith the Lord. Everyone who needs God to do this for them right now, raise your hands before the Lord. Mm -hmm. Pour down your blessings, Lord. Surely he shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowl and from the noise and pestilence. Now what? Thou shalt not be afraid for the terror by night, nor for the arrow that flieth by day. Now listen. You see what happens many times in the way that this army came in the middle of the night. Not only did they try to put fear in the middle of the night, but they also stuck around for the middle of the day, too. Mm, God can't do anything but fail. I'm going to show you how to get a miracle. I'm going to show you how to get a miracle. I want you to begin to dance. Come toward me now in that Holy Ghost dance. Come on, I'm gonna get you a miracle tonight. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you what he showed me. tonight the Lord was speaking to me and he said she dressed herself tonight in a garment of praise even though she didn't feel like it you were one of those people that God was telling me you got into his courts with Thanksgiving but you had to really force yourself to get in the Thanksgiving mode but this is what I hear the Lord say 
Your mind is gonna be made brand new tonight. Every spirit of oppression and depression is gonna run from you this night. Cause the devil is a liar, he's gonna take his filthy hands off of you. And the reason why he fights you the way he does is because God's gonna have ministry for you. I hear the Lord say, you have a gift from the time you were a little girl where you can speak into people's lives and see it come to pass. Is this true? Yes. And because of that, a lot of people have excluded you from being around them and with them because they're like, oh, you don't know what you're talking about. But the problem is you do know what you're talking about and they just are afraid of being revealed. You know what I'm talking about? But see, what they don't know is that the Holy Ghost is a gentleman and he don't reveal things to harm people or hurt them. He says things to deliver and to heal and set free. And you have a deliverance ministry in you. And God said tonight when you begin down to dance around in that aisle, the Lord said, the angel of the Lord is going to bring you a word of deliverance for you. And God said you're going to shine like God said you would shine in spite of the persecution, in spite of what they're saying, in spite of what they're doing. Come on, give God some praise. You gotta have something if you wanna dance with me. Nothing from nothing leaves nothing. You gotta have something if you wanna dance with me. prophetically from the Lord and if you notice I didn't have to tell her to dance that was a victory dance because the whole night I saw an angel of the Lord ma'am that stood behind you as I was reading God's Word God was preaching to me and showing me things to come for you and the Lord said the dance you just did he's ain't nothing compared to the one you're about to do because God said he gonna grab a hold of some wayward souls and people who have declined and denied and said, oh, we don't need that. God said, he got an angel that's going to bring deliverance to your household and those pertaining to it, and they shall get in the boat, saying, God, I see an ark. And the Lord said, as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. And God said, you will see the return of Jesus Christ. And in the return, everyone that you have claimed for the salvation of the Lord and your family, woo, they're going to do what God said do, daughter, is done. Come on, give God some praise. 